Hello Capricorn, welcome to your love reading, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. This is Mary from Mary's Tarot Corner. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Capricorn, this is a collective love message for your sign. So please take it how it resonates and what resonates for your overall situation. Let's see Capricorn. Let's see, what do we have for you? So Capricorn, you might be Divine Feminine or you are dealing with Divine Feminine, but mainly here we have someone who might have ghosted you, Capricorn. Um, they suddenly have gone quiet on you and it's like there is no closure regarding this whole situation. And I feel that because the way they kind of acted that way, you might felt that this person kind of played you. They never were really serious about the situation. For them, it was like a game of chess, you know. But things are going to change here because we have energy of for someone who wants to come across as thoughtful, kind, considerate, attentive. Um, the fact that we have reading about this person here, Capricorn, suggests that this person is thinking about you, the one who ghosted you, and they do want to reach out, you know, but it's like they are planning. This is someone who might be strat strategizing. It's a very difficult for me uh, word to pronounce, but, you know, they are planning how to do it. I feel that at the very beginning, this person was very thoughtful. They came across as someone who was kind, who was very attentive. They had time for you. Mm. They were very kind of understanding. But suddenly this person ghosted you. And it's like with delays, I feel that there is no contact situation between the two of you. At the moment. For some of you, you blocked this person. Because because what, what happened here between the two of you or how they handled this situation. Let's see. Show me more, please, for Capricorn and this situation. Six of Swords, Four of Wands, Knight of Swords and the Lovers. You might be dealing with Gemini. So we have three of wands, seven of wands, ten of cups, the hanged man, and we have a queen of swords. Strong gem Gemini energy indeed, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, overall energy, judgment. They want to come back. This is someone here who wants to be in touch. They have something to say. They want to resurrect this situation, this connection with you. You see, with the Knight of Swords, I feel that at the very beginning, this person was really chasing you here, Capricorn. But with the Six of Swords, it feels like there is a physical distance between the two of you. Maybe that, maybe it was like a long distance kind of thing, situationship or connection for of won't suggest that it was a relationship with the lovers yeah it, it, it felt that like what I am getting here that this person kind of made you feel that things can be okay between the two of you irrespective of that distance physical distance between the two of you because they were showing you that they truly care about this with the lovers and the four of wands and this knight of swords mm-hmm I'm getting that there were even a con there was a conversation about the future of this connection. Three of Wands. It's like this person was, yes, it's like this person was making plans. It's like they were telling you we are nearly there. You just need to wait a little bit longer, but but a little bit a, a little bit more. But we are nearly there, and we will be able with the Four of Wands, Ten of Cups, and the Lovers be together. Be together. And then suddenly something here happened and with the hanged man, 
it was like pause, silence, seven of wands. Yeah, this person, it feels like they, yeah, they, they've kind of walked away from this situation. And they pushed you away. For some of you, there was a situation. It was like a one day, this person was, a com it, it felt like you are talking here with someone else. Because the attitude was very kind of um, confrontational. It's like this person on purpose created a certain situation. And there was, they were very harsh with their words. Maybe they said something they created on purpose. Some sort of uh, argument or disagreement or tension between the two of you. And from that moment, this person wasn't in touch with you. Queen of Swords. I feel that you demand an explanation. That's what it is. But with the judgment, it feels like your wish will be granted here. Show me this person's feelings towards Capricorn. Show me this person's feelings towards Capricorn. They're spying on you, Capricorn. But it's like this person doesn't want you to know that they're doing that. High precious, yeah. They're keeping it as a secret. You might be dealing with Pisces. Page of Swords, they are very curious about you. This is someone who's thinking a lot about you as well, Capricorn. Because that's energy of curiosity. So in their feelings, they are thinking about you. You are on their mind. But with the Ace of Wands, I feel this person, because Ace of Wands is action. So they're doing something here to kind of find, in order to find out about what you, um, about you. So I see this person. Um, I feel this is someone who is trying to keep in tabs on you. This is someone here who is spying on you. If you have social media, they are, it's like this person is following your activity on social media. They are checking if you are online. For some of you, this is someone who has a different account. And you don't know about this account because it's like a secret with the high priestess and they are checking it from there you might have them in your friend group or like you know in your contacts but it's like you've never really spoken together or had a conversation i'm getting on an emotional level this person really wants to take action with the ace of wands they want to reach out but they, for now, they are. This is a no contact. They are not making here any move, but they want to do that, big time. It's like their heart is telling them. This, there is something here about them not having a full access to, I would say, to your life in the sense if you're posting or if you're active on social media, they don't have a full access and they are very curious about. Again, what's going on in your, in your life, what you're up to. But Ace of Wands, it's, it's communication, action, wanting to do something in order to gain some sort of results. And then we have this Seven of Cups. This person, it's like they are spying on you, but they don't know exactly what's going on. And they are assuming a lot. This is someone who's fantasizing a lot about you, about this connection. They're assuming here many, many things. This is someone who also feels that you have options in love. They want to, you're dealing here with someone who can be quite noisy, noisy, can I say that? Someone who really wants to figure out what you're up to. And the fact that they don't have that full access or if you don't have social media, they, they, you know, they don't know what's going on in your life. I feel this, it's, it's, it's seriously playing on this person's mind, Capricorn. Because it might be a case that you, you block this person, free of swords, they broke your heart.
and it's like it's that it's the consequences of their action because they, they didn't have to ghost you they didn't have to ghost you show me this person's uh, you might be dealing with virgo show me this person's um actions towards capricorn we have the world we have the moon we have the six of wands okay and we have an ace of pentacles so they're going to reach out and we have this three of swords again at the bottom of the deck so capricorn you might be dealing with pisces we have leo aquarius taurus scorpio the world the moon you're going to receive a message from this person they're going to take action with the six of wands they want your attention so you can expect here that this person i'm getting someone's going to wish you a happy new year and that will be like a because it will be late at night and uh, they're going to wish you a happy new year see happy new year um mm -hmm. and i feel this person will come with the initiative that you know if both of you can meet up and talk about this situation or it's like they would want it to talk about this what happened between the two of you and it will be out of nowhere because i feel that you're going to fe think like well why they why they want to talk about this with the moon i feel that you don't trust this person this is someone who broke your heart the way they acted by ghosting you because they came across you know they made a certain impression on you and it felt like it really looked really promising and i feel it was really heartbroken how heartbreaking for you the way they acted and at the end it felt like they really kind of played you yeah this is someone who has so much explaining to do but you know with the three of swords it feels like certain things here you will have an opportunity to address this emotional disappointment dissatisfaction and how they made you feel that sadness you will have an opportunity here to indeed to talk about this this situation that broke your heart show me the outcome just this the death card three of pentacles four of pentacles ace of swords and the four justice okay so you might be dealing with scorpio capricorn i have libra i have aries and i have aquarius there will be a progress regarding this situation justice here will be served and that's what is very important for you to know because overall energy is justice it's if you f if you feel that the situation was handled without justice and fairness you justice here will be served at the end of the day this person is going to reach out they will try to explain themselves they will balance things out with you they will try it at least but this situation will be handled with truth honesty and and um and fairness because that's what justice means that there is a need for for fairness regarding this situation um we have quite interesting cards because the first card here for your outcome is the death card and the last one is the fool it feels very strongly that this person with the ace of swords yes they 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 will try to clear the air with you and they would want it to have a new beginning but this card suggests that yes indeed something here ended between the two of you and i feel that you've also changed your perspective about this or it's like you see this person completely differently 
Three of Pentacles suggests that you'll be in touch with them. You'll be talking here about many, many things, but I'm seeing you keeping cards very, very close to your chest. It's like you're going to be very selective with your energy. Things will be different this time. Very, very different. I'm seeing you being closed off, not fully trusting this person. It's like they will have to really make an effort and reassure you that they, they care a lot about you. Because with the Four of Pentacles, I'm seeing you, mm, I'm protecting my heart. Also, you know, the clarity of my mind. So this person won't be able to kind of, you know, play, manipulate me or play a game with me. And also your stability, being very grounded, very down to earth. I feel that you are all about the clarity with the Ace of Swords, which that card also represents. But this person here will try to clear the air with you because it will also kind of in their mind will give will will give them opportunity. This person feels like if they clear the air with you, that they will have an opportunity for a new beginning with you. And with the full they want to have a new beginning with you or regarding this connection. But I'm seeing you being quite closed off to be honest with you with the four of pentacles keeping cards very close to your chest and it's like uh -uh, i'm not going to reach out to them if this person really cares they will be in touch with me they will be the one they will be making um effort they will go an extra mile because because of what happened mm -hmm. nevertheless expect that they they're going to reach out and this, this situation will be treated with justice and you will have your justice. It's like justice will be served. And this connection and this situation will be treated with justice and fairness. Capricorn. Capricorn, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly, truly appreciate you. Capricorn, have a fantastic an absolutely gorgeous day and once again thank you very much for being with me i'm sending you much much love till next time take care bye